In this video, I'm going to talk about Voltino. Voltino is a meme coin launched in 2021 at the very end of a bull market. So the team has been building for the past two years and they almost two years and they have come to some interesting stuff. So I wanted to go through that because uh, it's not often that the teams, especially of meme coins, are building for the entire bear market and trying to build and bring new stuff. Uh, so we're going to go through Vault Inu and see what's inside. So first of all, you can see this new website. Uh, it also comes with a new smart contract. Uh, for the token, there's the version two of the of the token itself. Uh, Vault Inu, the people's crypto. Basically, right now, Vault Inu is not only a meme coin; it's also a one-stop shop offering different DeFi products, as you can see. And they want to make sure that uh, some of the profits are coming back to the users. So, first of all, you have the uh, the exchange that is listing also new projects, Vault Exchange. Uh, you have an NFT collections for the uh, for the holders. You have different games. So Volti Games, a racing game, which is play to earn and different uh, gives you different rewards. Uh, there's also some new utility coming with uh, the new tech like AI automation and so on. And also there's a new mystery project to be launched in 2023 uh, to be announced yet. You can see the tokenomics. As you can see also, Vault Inu is on three blockchains, Ethereum blockchain, Binance Smart Chain, and Polygon. Uh, and you can see uh, the tokenomics being uh, on each of those chains, as well as contract, uh, contract address to check it out. Uh, you can also buy Vaulty, uh, Vault Inu on any kind of the, the exchange on Vaulty chain, but also on most of the other exchanges as well, as well as different centralized exchanges as well. So probably the link will be down below to some of them. Uh, so Vaulty exchange, Vaulty change uh, is a decentralized exchange that allows projects to get listed uh, in a free and permissionless way and make them be become deflationary by, by burning the supply. So no liquidity to add, uh, fee burning, uh, and a bunch of other stuff. So you can use the product from Vaulty change to, uh, from Vaulty Inu to actually launch your own own project, uh, which is pretty cool. A bunch of news being uh, are, are talking about Vault Inu. There are games as well uh, using Vault as the main uh, currency. Uh, Vault card, so you can get a physical virtual debit card that allows users to spend money, which is pretty pretty cool. And this is powered by Visa, accepted worldwide, uh, traded on 82 centralized exchanges. So they have basically everyone here on board with them. Uh, and there is the, this extensive roadmap of different stages, starting with stage one. That was, uh, as I mentioned, a year and a half ago, end of 2021 with the, with the launch. Uh, they quickly went through some of the stages and then uh, they are currently at the stage number five. With the new website, Polygon Bridge, Rewards, Vaulty Card Launch and a bunch of other products as well, which is pretty cool. And the, as you can see, they, they are working on other things as well here. Uh, the list is getting bigger and bigger, uh, different partners, uh, news, if you want to get through the news, uh, there's, there's NFT collection for all the, for the, all the Vaulty new fans, uh, Vaulted Dragon Sailors Club, uh, and different socials if you want to follow them. All together, really well put, uh, really like the fact that they keep on building through 2022, which was a very hard year for crypto, and we are well into 2023 and they are still building. So this is great stuff, uh, really great ideas as well. It's not often that, for example, a meme coin launches its own credit card or debit card. Uh, that's also great. So uh, check them out. Of course, this is not a financial advice, purely educational content. Uh, all the links will be down below in the description. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more content on meme coins, new chains, new DeFi protocols, and much more. Subscribe and see you in the next video.